My name's Helen Slater, and I've got a bit of a mixed background, but I trained initially as a physiotherapist, and that's still what I do as part of my role. And in addition to that, I work as a clinical researcher in this area. I'm uh, Dr Stephanie Davies. My interest is in pain medicine. I'm what's called, I was initially what's called an anaesthetic doctor with an interest in pain medicine, but as you know, the one or two decades have passed on, I'm pretty much just do what's called pain medicine now, so I'm what's called a pain doctor. This is a project that Dr Stephanie Davies and myself have been very passionate about for a number of years. Um, as a physiotherapist and a clinician working in pain medicine, I'm all too aware of the gap in service to many people who live both in rural and remote areas of WA, as well as in metropolitan uh, Perth, in getting access to an appropriate and um, scientifically based approach for their pain problem. I guess knowledge is, is freedom, so if you can understand your situation or anything that you're going through, it's going to be a lot easier to manage it and pain would be the ultimate. Yeah, this project um, appealed to me and I was willing to put time into it because working with patients over a period of time who've got pain, one of the things you notice that pain enters their life, it's a huge change for them. They're overwhelmed often and the range of information that's available to them again is overwhelming. It's, um, there's different qualities in it, some of it's really good, some of it's less useful, less evidence-based. So um, being involved in this project gives me an opportunity to take some of the more evidence-based ideas, uh, the ones that have been tested and we've shown have good clinical outcomes, um, and, and actually spread that information to the broadest range of people. It's lovely when they can come in and see you individually, but when they're stuck off in the bush, their needs are just as... as um, clear, uh, but they don't have the resources that they can access. So being able to um, talk to them you know, today is, is a great middle ground. It's lovely to see them, but if we can't, then at least they can see us.